you might think they're making ice cream. But actually, this is how a soccer ball is born. First, workers dip a four-petal mold into hot liquid rubber. When it's pulled out, the rubber coats the surface evenly, forming the soft, round shape of the inner bladder. Next, it goes into a vulcanizing chamber, where heat transforms the liquid rubber into a tough, elastic solid. After cooling and trimming the edges, a small air valve is added. And just like that, the bladder's ready. To make it stronger, layers of high tensile nylon threads are tightly wound all around it, giving the ball both structure and shock resistance. Then, 20 hexagons and 12 pentagons are coated with hot melt glue and pieced together into two perfect half shells. Finally, the bladder and panels are pressed together under intense heat and pressure. The glue melts, the seams vanish, and just a few minutes later, a flawless soccer ball is ready for the game.